Paso, Adrian Alvarez is here with KB Realty and I am here at one of my listings at 669 Las Granjas in the Upper Valley. Gorgeous backyard here, but I want to talk to you to all those home sellers out there who are getting ready to put their house on the market who need to sell this summer and who might need to upgrade into something bigger. Um, I wanted to talk to you because I just did some digging on the numbers and you need to get your home on the market right now. You cannot wait one second longer and here's why. I'm going to give you uh, some statistics here to my left and to your right. So in last year's summer selling season, that's the months between May and August, that's when we see on average higher number of sales per month in those four months. Um, and we saw that for all home sales around a little more than 600 per month in each of those months. Um, specifically though, I want to talk to those who are uh, selling their already lived in home, what we call in the business resales. Um, I took a look at the numbers and if you need to sell this summer, the majority of homes that sold during the last year's summer season were listed either in March or in April. In fact, 286 homes in each of those months actually sold either in March or April when it was listed in those months. So right now we're already in March 8th. You do not want to wait a second longer. And I can actually pinpoint if you need to sell by a certain date when you should actually list it. It's what I call the two month rule for our summer selling season. So if you need to sell by May, to get your house on the market right now in the month of March. The most of the homes that sold in May were actually listed in March of that same year of 2016. Uh, if you need to sell your house in June, then you need to list it no later than April. And if you can list it in March, even better. So people during spring break can actually get a look at your home before next week's week off from school and distractions and whatnot. Also, if you need to, say, sell the home no later than July, then you need to get your house on the market no later than May. Same thing goes for August. If you list your house then in August, you cannot list your house any later than June. And even doing that, I would say, is a little bit risky uh, because uh, most of our home sales that we saw, even during the summer selling season, closed in May closed in June. So what does that mean? You need to get your house on the market March and April. I want to go ahead and tell you to click on the link above and that's where you can fill out the information about your property. I will give you a free comparative market analysis if you decide to list with me. Um, and the big key thing that you need to know when you're listing your home is how to price it to sell. Uh, the big um, number that I found in these home sales was that they were sold at or near their listing price, which means they didn't try to overprice it from the get-go. So what I'll do, I'll take a look at the numbers, I'll take a look at the market, see what your house should sell for, and we'll price it near there to get a quick closing. So go ahead, click the link above. I'd love to be able to help you sell your home and also show you how I'll market your home to make sure it sells. Talk soon. Bye.